And then over the years, it crossed between many, many religious traditions. The story, which is part of Jain, and Buddhist, and Sufi, and Hindu lore, reflects connections between those faith traditions. Let's see if we can make a connection to this story also. Ready? Once upon a time, there were six men, and not one of them was able to see. Each man had heard stories about an animal called an elephant, but none had ever encountered a real live elephant. Well, one day a traveling circus came to town where the men lived, and along with the acrobats and clowns, there were all kinds of animals, including an elephant. What motivates me to act or feel the way that I do? 
and maybe as importantly, what motivates other people to act the way they do or to feel the way they do. We will share music and words of wisdom from many faith traditions and worldviews, some of which will be very different from our own. But rather than take any of these views and teachings to be ultimate statements of absolute truth, we can instead open up our minds and evaluate these questions by asking ourselves this very practical question about any of us. Is this particular teaching that I'm hearing today is it leading my heart and my mind to greater kindness and compassion? Is this particular teaching leading me to greater wisdom and peace? Because if it is, then I believe there is value in the teaching, no matter its source. So I thank Chris and Tony and Jose and Danny and Gavin and Bennett and Jacob and Larry for their help, and I thank you all for listening so very intimately.